Hey everybody, BrickLover18 here today with a vlog, another vlog here in my Lego room. I haven't actually made just a random vlog in a really long time and that's because it's been so long since I've just had a few days to chill in my Lego room without any major videos or anything to make. So I've just been getting caught up and having a lot of fun building and I thought I might as well pick up my camera and show you what I'm up to. So the biggest thing that I've really been working on is of course the Lego City. I will show you all of that in the LEGO City Rebuild updates, which is not this video, this is just a vlog, but you've seen a lot of the work I've been doing on that. So I've been in here these last few days building things, like I got to build traffic lights, which are really cool, I haven't built them in so long. As well, what took me a few hours was building this new tile square, which I'm so excited to do. And as I said, you know, building traffic lights and even building tile square, those are just mocks that I haven't done in so long, like I don't, I do not remember the last time I was just in my Lego room, you know, playing away, building some mocks. As you can see, both my tables are absolutely covered in parts. Also this afternoon, which will not be in a Lego City update, I've been working on building this Lego stage, which I'm really excited about. I've had a stage for a really long time, but it was pretty, you know, it was in really bad shape and I needed to repair it. So I pulled it out. I actually added a bunch of things to it. I made it a little bit bigger. It fits in the street perfectly. And I'm just really excited for how this, how this you know, mock looks. I'm going to actually fill it up with people and I'm probably going to put it on display or something like that in one of my bookshelves because obviously it can't stay in the Lego City forever. It's just for a special event. But I'm really excited for how it looks and it was a lot of fun to build. I'm going to make a full video on it because I've not made a mock video in like a really long time. So I'm excited to make that and show you some of its cool features because there's some hidden things that you wouldn't even know about. And then that kind of brings me to back over to my Lego table. As you can see, there are just parts absolutely everywhere. I have half my bins are pulled out as well because I've been going back and forth between panels and tons of plates. And I've used Technic, which I never use, and then bricks and studs and clips and tiles and all that good stuff. As you can see, a bunch of things from the stage, which I'm not going to get rid of because I still want to keep. But other things from the stage, you know, this is one of the a, a set I kept. This was the old ball that I, I showed in the LEGO City update. This is what used to be kind of in my tile square. And now I've got that incredible ball, which I'm really excited about. That uses way more pieces, obviously, than like the 15 that are here. And that uses almost 100. But... I'm so excited because it looks so much better and I still want to do some cool things to that maybe to make it look even better because I just I love it though I'm really excited and then over here as you can see again just building and building and parts everywhere I'm gonna have so much to sort after this this is not also like a room tour it's just some updates to my shelf I don't know when I'm gonna be posting this video but obviously I'm filming it after I last built and had my moving vlog or like my re renovation vlog, I guess you could say, where I did a lot of moving around on these shelves. I haven't really changed anything since the finale of that. If not, you're getting a little bit, if I'm posting this before, you're probably getting a little sneak preview. But as you can see, I just got different things from my city all over the place. And I'm still working to try and get the city back under control. And those are ongoing LEGO City updates. So they're a lot of fun and you'll have to stay tuned for those. And then of course, I'm also on the other side of my studio. You know, I just finished filming a review of this really awesome, Mickey Mouse set which is 43179. I'll actually be posting this on November 18th which is my birthday which I'm very excited about. I've been doing lots of things with the store recently but I haven't really made any videos on that and I have to do more with the store because as you can see down here I actually have a lot of sets that I need to I need to get going on. These are ones ready to be parted out and these ones are also some are parted out some are ready to be added to the store and I've also got two shelves here of sets that I need to make videos on. You know I've got the new Christmas set. I'm waiting for the giveaway winner to contact me about that prize. I've got the Super Mario Bros build up here which I'm just kind of trying to bring myself to make a review on that. In the mail the other day, I also just got this project, which I'm really excited about, the High Tech Lego Projects book, so I'll be making a video on that. But lots of cool things coming here, and then of course my set is ready to go, and I finally put it all back together after the last like moving vlogs and renovation vlogs and things like that. So all is going well in my Lego room. It was so clean recently, but now it's getting kind of messy again. But I just I wanted to pick up my camera and make this video because I haven't seen my Lego room look like this in a while. Like this, it looks like a classic Lego builder is in the middle of building their projects with drawers pulled out, parts everywhere, and it was just 
a lot of fun to kind of get back into the swing of things. And I might, you know, as I said, I've still got other things to do for my city, so I'm excited to be continuing to build mocks. And I think one part I want to do a little bit more on is mock building. Like, I make a lot of videos, and I do things for my YouTube channel a lot, and I build sets, but I, I want to get building some more mocks and other my own creations and stuff like that. So I think I'm going to start carving out and making sure I do time to do all that. But anyway, thank you so much for watching this really quick Lego vlog. As I said, I just want to pick up my camera and do like a brief overview of what I've been working on these last few days. It has been so much fun doing these mock buildings, working on my city, and then just making some videos on the side. So anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed. Let me know down in the comments below if you have any suggestions or anything of mocks I should build for my LEGO room next. I really would love to hear it. So thanks again so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and have a great day.